What's going on guys? Michael here. Happy Father's Day to all you dads. I am recording this a little bit early because I am going to be gone to youth camp this Tuesday. So yay, I don't want to do another punishment. My body apparently hates me. After I got all of Haiti out of my system and I was back on normal flowing schedule, my head decided to attack my body and I uh, have a sinus infection and an eye infection. That's why I'm wearing my glasses and I sound like a smoker. So, this video will not be very long as well because I, once again, do not feel well. Right before I'm about to go on a week-long trip with a bunch of junior high kids. So, I got this new watch. Obviously, it's not even on yet. I hope it works. I'm actually pretty excited about it. It's digital because I can't tell what the analog clocks say. Still takes me a while to tell time on those things and I'm 25 years old. Anyone else have that problem, or is it just me? Hey, this weekend has been really fun, besides me um, wanting to chop my head off because I feel like crap. We had uh, kids camp, which was awesome. There was over 375 kids. We had 200 volunteers, just a ton of fun, just craziness all at church. That was Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Um, and then we've got youth camp, like I said, coming up this upcoming week. So it's been a busy three weeks back to back where I've had something take up uh, a lot of my time. I'm ready for this month to be over and ready to just kind of be back on normal schedule. Look, my watch is working now. Yay, yay. So I really have no idea what's going on in the world. I know this one guy named Wiener did something. He's like a politician. Um, apparently it was a bit scandalous. Can anyone say his name without sounding like an immature 12 year old? No, no one can. It's impossible. Representative Wiener. It just makes me laugh. My sister was trying to tell me this. Apparently, he he tweeted something, and he had been taking pictures of himself in little to no clothing or something like that. And one of the tweets that he sent out, he attached a picture, which was accidentally one of the pictures of um, him scantily clad. And uh, then he tried to say that he was hacked or something like that. I don't really know what happened, but... I do know that he got busted, and uh, he should probably be on the next MSNBC to catch a predator. Well, that's something you got to know. I'm Chris Hansen with Dateline NBC. It's like a train wreck. You can't take your eyes off of it. You have to watch it, and you just, I don't feel bad for the guys. It's just awkward. Hope you guys have a great week. See you next week.